Hello YouTube, and uh, start today by looking at a drill. This is the drill. It's one of them. A PSR 1200, isn't that great? And there's a drill. Ta-da! As you notice, the battery's out of it because the battery is the problem. So someone's given this to me to see if I can get it working again because the battery is broken. And here is said battery. Now, uh, oh, I'll just knock stuff off. Uh, let's see if we can find out what this battery is. So we've got big 12 volts written there. It's a Bosch jobby. What does that say? Is there anything interesting? NICAD. Oh, that's going to be uh, old and also broken. That'd be why it isn't working. Uh, 1.2 amp hours, so no power in there whatsoever. Yeah, NICAD. So it's a one. So yeah, it's a it's a NICAD pack. So. Yeah, it's an old thing. I don't know why he wants it fixed, really, personally. But, you know, that is... We don't question. We don't judge. We just do. So the first thing we have is one, two, three, four screws. Or three screws. And a weird hole. Which... Don't know what the hole's for. I'll take the three screws out and see what happens. All right, three screws to be removed. So the three screws are out, but it's not coming out. So I think this is actually a security steel seal to stop you from getting in it. So I think I need to cut this bit of plastic away. And it feels like there's a screw there. This feels like that corner's being held down. So it needs to somehow get that. It's, a, it's not a bung. It looks like it is a piece of plastic. Or is it a bung? Might need to get a knife in there, see if I can pop it out. I drilled out the hole because I couldn't get the bung out. And there is a screw. Right. Let's remove it. Right, the reveal. Yeah, it's not much of a reveal, is it, right now? Oh, heck, what's going on here? Let's see. Wait a minute, you got to push these clips in and then pull it. Right, two seconds. And there is the reveal. There's nothing under there. And there is the cells. So what do we have? A lot of very dead, probably, NICADs. Eee, right. Ooh, crusty. Is that just dust from DIY, or is that leaky cells? I don't know. Anyway, we'll try and get the packs, packs out. Well, these cells are completely dead because there's no way you measure it from. Everything measures zero. There's not even a hint of life. So, these cells are bad. What do we do? Do we find equivalent nickel metal hydride cells and resell it? Or do we fill it for lithium? Or do we just tell them to buy a new drill that's better? But that's not what we do. We try and fix things. So, what can we do? Um, I'll have to have a look. I'll have a look for whatever size these are. So these have got part number on them. If that is a part number, we'll see if they do do them size of cells. Otherwise, we'll see what lithium cells we can fit in there. Because it would only need 4.2, what, 3 lithium cells? We can even boost it up to 4. We can get, can we get, I mean, 18650s can we sit in this packet. Let's have a little play. Oh. They would, would fit, wouldn't they? They would fit, you know. Hmm. That's intriguing. Will they fit that way as well? Easy. So we could put 18650s in there. Yeah, it's an idea. But if we do 18650s, the charger needs to be different. All right, I'm going to have to think about this. Right, this is my little project. I need to get some cells. Uh, you probably see this update in another upcoming video when I finally get some cells or put lithium in it. But for now, I'm going to leave it there. That's a future project. Right. So, on that note, I shall see you later. Bye for now.